Cheers. Let's get this paint potion on the canvas. Um, this is from Penhurst when I went to Penhurst Paracon a couple years ago, as I said in the first episode of this, but I wanted to just give you more of an update. I went two years ago, I painted with the energy, I played singing bowls with the energy, that's what the sound is with this. Um, there might be a little bit of where I was talking about people that kept coming out in the parking lot while I was playing. But anyway, I love this one so much, I call it River of Tears and Blood. At the very end, whenever you see the close-up and everything, you'll see um, this part here in the middle just looks like a river. And the stories from um, the people who lived there and the way they were treated and all of the sadness, the, the energy that I felt there was sadness and... Um, so this just felt really fitting. This piece just felt fitting. The other piece felt fitting as well. But um, yeah, I hope you like it. I have a few more episodes for this. And you can see the whole thing um, as it comes together. And I've been saving this for October because of um, spooky season is a great time to share spirit guided art like um, from a haunted location like that. And um, I don't know. This is one of my favorite pieces ever, so it's in my living room still today. Um, but let me know what you think, and I'll shut up so you can watch the rest of the series now with sound magic that I played there as well. I did the painting and the recording, um, about 15 minutes away, but it was still, the energy was still, I can tap into energy from anywhere. And if you missed it, you can find this series from the first one on my YouTube or my TikTok in collections or playlists.